Field in line. Seven and a half furlongs thereof. China Crossing walks out. Mr. Zip heads straight for that lead and gets it as they run past the seven. The three-year-old classy prospect settled down two lengths in behind him. Racing up just off the rail, below the waist, right against it. Eloping Emma just wide of those and running in fourth. A break of two and a half lengths in behind her to Rolex. Racing ahead of Big Diva on the rail, asked to make ground. Platinum Valley further back. Emmanuel and Katie is next, and a China crossing laboring last. As they've left the five with Mr. Zip heading toward the half mile, still two lengths in front of Classy Prospect held on the outside of below the waist rail running. They're into the half mile turn, and Mr. Zip continues to lead up by some two and a half lengths. Now asked to stretch it. Below the waist and Classy Prospect team up in behind. A gap opens up to Rolex in the orange and green. Big Diva next along with Eloping Emma. Emmanuel and Katie is a further three and a half lengths back as they go past the three and head to the five. 516 followed up by Platinum Valley and driven at the back is China Crossing but Mr. Zip yet to be caught. He gets a crack at the right hand stick and enters the stretch run with a quarter of a mile to go. Classy Prospect now asked to get to him along with Below the Waist. Over on the rail that's Rolex making heavy weather of it. Further back to Big Diva in the green and white in the center. Mr. Zip arrives at the furlong pole. Here's Below the Waist and Classy Prospect now nibbling into the lead. Mr. Zip driven to the max with a 16th to run. Below the waist on the rail. Classy prospect making hard work of it on the outside. This Mr. Zip is fighting them off to win it. Over below the waist. Classy prospect could only manage its third. China crossing fourth. In the winner's enclosure, the unofficial winner of today's fifth, number six, Mr. Zip, a six-year-old chestnut horse by Rizzi, Vegas Bride by Time for a Change, Bread Says Who, Thoroughbreds, on the two docks, trained Dwight Chen, the rider, Dane Nelson, second one, below the waist, third five, Classy Prospect, four three, China Crossing. Running time, 1,500 meters, 1 minute, 33 and 1. After the official goes up for the fifth event, no racing from Philadelphia Park. As a result, we'll be bringing for you races three and four from Turf Paradise. But to do this, we have to shut down the system to accommodate facilities to carry races three and four for Turf Paradise. It will only be for a short time. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause. But it's for your benefit, those of you who love to gamble from Turf Paradise. Once again, there will be an emergency meeting on Monday, March 1st, 10, beginning at 10 a.m. in the jockey's room. And, of course, this is for jockey's agents. It's an emergency meeting of the jockey's agents. So an emergency meeting for jockey's agents, Monday, March 1st, beginning at 10 a.m. in the jockey's room. Please make every effort to attend agents. And the United Racehorse Trainers Association of Jamaica will be having a general meeting Thursday, March 4, 9.30 a.m. in the trainer's room. The future of trainers will be addressed. Guest speakers from several institutions will be there. Brunch will be served. 
So that's the United Racehorse Trainers Association of Jamaica. We'll be having a general meeting Thursday, March 4, beginning at 9.30 a.m. in the trainers' room.